Okay, so I'd like to make an announcement. Ready? Making an announcement. Da 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 da. Make an announcement. My name is Marcus Conti, and I am officially running for Senator of New York State. New York State Senator. The election will be November 6, 2018. Pow, I'm in the ring. <laughs> Senator. Senator Conti. Senator Conti. Is it a joke? Hell no. Hell no, man. It's not a joke at all. Trying to upseat the current uh, senator that uh, comes up for re-election in 2018 is Kirsten Gillibrand. We're going to get rid of her. She's the one who preceded Crooked Hillary Clinton. Right? She took Crooked Hillary Clinton's seat and gave it to Kristen Gillibrand. So we got to get rid of these people. Right? They got to go. Right? Chuck Schumer's in there too. We could get in there. I'm going to get in there and I'm going to stick my elbow in his eye like this. I'm going to put my elbow right in his eyeball. Yeah, Chuck Schumer. Pa, put my elbow in your eye. All right, so what's my what's my uh, platform? I'm serious. This is totally serious. Right? It's going to be right in, of course, because who wants to spend you know um, tens of thousands of dollars that I don't have to get on a ballot that's probably already too late to do that. But we don't we don't need that because it's, again, it's a shitty rigged system anyway, right? So if people are going to vote for me, they're going to you you just can write it in in New York. So in complete seriousness, right? This is my platform, right? Free universal single-payer health care for all. Pow, done deal. U.S. should have had it uh, 25 years ago, right? No reason in the world a, a, a wealthy civilization, a wealthy nation like the United States doesn't have, doesn't cover all of its citizens for health care, right? Free college tuition at city and state colleges. Done deal, right? Free college, right? Now, that's not to say if you want to go to Princeton and Yale and spend a lot of money uh, and you're a rich guy and you want to, you know, send your kids to the rich school, you can do that. But for everybody else, college and uh, college at city and state universities will become free. Term limits, both Congress and Senate. Two years. Two years. After you do your two years, time to go, right? Make room for somebody else. You run. You serve. And you go. Legalize all drugs. That was the next one. Legalize all drugs. Now, that works in conjunction with free universal single-payer health care. Because if you legalize drugs, you not only eliminate the drug, the so-called drug war, but you also give, you give a big pharma a real kick in the ass, right? We don't want, because big pharma has been ripping us off for so long, right? But it can't do that anymore. So... Legalize all drugs. We'll figure the rest out later. Marijuana, look, you see it's already legal. The alcohol, it's already legal. So just legalize everything and we'll put that put the money saved in law enforcement, put it into rehabilitation and wake people up a little bit. Next one, full right to bear arms. No questions asked. <clears throat> right? Full right to bear arms to prevent people like me from running from running for office and then suddenly Changing his tune when he gets there, right? Because <clears throat> I'm not going to do that. But I'm just making the point that most politicians today, uh, you know, they, they run for, for office and then they get into office and then they, they start taking money from the donors. Two years, time to go, right? All right? And, and the right to bear arms, that's what I was trying to say. The right to bear arms is that if they don't go, you, 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 that's why we have arms, to prevent tyranny. Also, next one, four-day work week, right? People work too hard, right? Five days is too many it's too many days in a row to be working, right? Four days, four, maybe four a little longer days, introduced a nine-hour work week, but only four days. So you can have three days off to be with your children and, to, and enjoy your life and to, to live your, a nice life in America again, right? Next one, convert U.S. power grid to 100% wind and solar by 2024. So... Is that unrealistic? No, not really, because there's plenty of wind and there's plenty of solar. All we got to do is knock out the the uh, the oil industry, right? And how are we going to do that? I'm getting I'm getting to it. I'm getting to it. I'm getting to it. I'm getting to it. Right? Oil to total wind and solar power by 2020. It's easy. The solar panels exist. We already have the wind technology. All the technology is in place. There's just no political will to do it. Right? Next, raise the corporate tax rate to 80 percent. That's right. That's what FDR did. That's the New Deal, right? That's what the New Deal was all about. I think he went even as high as 85%, 90%. But 
I'll raise it to 80. I'll petition to raise it to 80 percent. And then we can then and then the next one is make tax evasion and tax avoidance illegal again. So we close the, the tax loopholes. Right. And if you break the law, boom, off to jail. You go, you the politicians, two years, you go, you get caught taking the money, boom, jail time, right? Make t make taking bribes and bribing politicians illegal again. It's a done deal, right? So that's where we get the money. So if you're saying, oh, where you get the money, Conti, that's where you get the money, right? Senator Conti, excuse me. Reduce military spending by 80%. That's right, 80%. That takes care of the insurgency war crap. And uh, a lot of the, the need to go and fight these stupid wars ends because you don't have the corporate ins you don't have the corporatists and the globalists pushing their agenda uh, uh, down the, 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 you know, the universal throat of the world, right? So that, that's, that's a problem. And lastly, not, but not leastly, close the FBI and the CIA. Pow. So now that I'm officially running for the Senate of New York, I'm going to take my oath to you because um, I just think it's cool to do. So I'm going to take the oath of office, the, um, the, the swearing in, right, as a senator. Right? So here we go. Put it over here so I can see myself. Ah, beautiful. I'm ready. I, Mark, Marcus Conti, do solemnly swear that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation freely without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion, and that I will, I will well and faithfully discharge the duties of the office on which I'm about to enter. So help me God. So it's official. Right? If you're in New York... Gillibrand, step aside, step aside, step aside, Miss Gillibrand. If you're in New York, you know, spread this around. Vote for me, Marcus Conti. Peace out.